<laughs> All right. Uh, I'm Nick Basley here at the First Glance Film Festival Hollywood, and uh, I'm here joined by Camden Toy. And you're here with the Godmother. Uh, that's correct. Yeah. How'd you get involved with that production? Um, boy, I think it came through the you know regular channels of the Breakdown Services. If that's that's my vague memory of it, it's it, we shot it about a year and a half ago. So you know, so all those things, a casting of things, some kind of, sometimes kind of uh, kind of all falls together and in, in, uh, each other. So. What was your involvement in the movie? Like, what was your role? Uh, I play uh, the character who is sort of the um, marriage counselor slash um, hitman. <laughs> the ultimate solution to marriage problems. <laughs> yeah, it's, it was a really fun, I mean, it's, it's really, it's, I mean, it's truly, a, it's a comedy, romance, martial arts film. It's, it's just a lot of fun, and uh, we spent, uh, I, I think close to a week shooting it, um, eight, seven, eight days, something like that, and uh, we shot it in studio because we were, you know, th the set gets destroyed because there's like gunfire and, you know, fist fighting and, you know, knife fighting and, you know, just, you know, general mayhem. So the, the, as the days went on, we actually just literally destroyed the set. I crashed through the window, or actually I should say my stunt double crashed just through the window, and then suddenly they cut back to me, yeah. yeah. And you're fine, you're just like, yep, that was great. That's right, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Um, it, how is it working with Lior? Oh, he's uh, he's great. He's very he's very relaxed. I don't think there was a moment, you know, because we're shooting on a pretty tight schedule, and there's a lot of fighting, a lot of stunts, which can be trying uh, at times. And I don't think uh, there was one point where he ever had any kind of there was ever any tension or any like oh my god we're gonna be uh, uh, it was just, it was, he was always very cool and calm and uh, that that was actually refreshing to work with because you know not everybody works well under pressure so. do you have uh, any advice for other actors out there that are maybe even just getting started that uh, might help them out working with newer directors or anything like that? Uh, you know my advice is uh, just work uh, and work on anything that will come along whether it's paying or not paying uh, I mean certainly it's preferable if you can get a paying gig but um, that's what all my friends keep telling me but <laughs> but um, yeah but, I mean I've been acting since I was a kid I grew up in a theatrical family and honestly you just you know you know young 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 actors think they need to pick and choose their projects the fact is you just need to work you need the experience of, of auditioning you need the experience in front of the camera and you need the experience of working with other, other actors so uh, I would just it just work 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 out of out of all the roles that you had, do you have a favorite? Uh, I have several favorites actually, uh, but probably my my most favorite is a, a character I played on Buffy the Vampire Slayer called Gnarl in uh, season seven, uh, third episode called Same Time Same Place, and he was literally the Hannibal Lecter of the demon world. So that was a really fun role to play. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, how do you, how you how are we treating you here at the First Glance Film Festival so far? Uh, well, I just got here, so so far great. <laughs> Well, thank you for coming, and we appreciate you being a part of, of the First Glance Film Festival here in Hollywood, and uh, thank you very much for taking the time out to talk with us. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks so much.
Yeah, well, do you, yeah, do you have my... Uh, don't have yours, but I will give you mine. Oh, okay, cool. Um, yeah, Amber, actually, the very first episode of uh, Buffy in season four, uh, Hush, was actually her first episode as well. Yeah. Oh, she's so she's so great. We also just interviewed Sam Levine um, oh. uh, last week. Okay. Um, but a little connection there being that they're doing drones now, and, and yeah, we were promoting I'm, both I'm of that. Yeah, I'm seeing that on... Tuesday, right? Tuesday, Tuesday. At the Tuesday, Egyptian? Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah, she yeah. sent me, she sent me a little leaving, note about it. Oh, I'm leaving back to Massachusetts on yeah. tomorrow morning. I was yeah. so ticked. I really wanted to go. Yeah. Um, oh, but I yeah. love her. I've, yeah, I've known her since 1999 when we, she, when we shot Hush. Yeah, she was actually yeah. our first celebrity guest that we ever had on the yeah. show, and she was so nice. She gave us like a whole hour, and she's we, great. she was promoting um, Death's Daughter at the time, and now we're having her back on to talk about drones and cat's claw. It was great. Yeah, what's great is also she's just so diverse. Oh, yeah, yeah, we've been done. <laughs>